Sissy was this very responsible, loving, wholesome kind of character. Brian Keith, who played Uncle Bill, he was this kind of macho man, but he had this just heart of gold. And he was wonderful with Sebastian Cabot, who played Mr. French. Sebastian had a big problem in learning lines. And so he would, over the weekend, go and just memorize every single word. And he'd come to the set, and he would go over the lines with the dialogue coach. After the show, Sebastian Cabot took on another show and a series and continued to do voiceover work. But he was never really very healthy. He died of a stroke. Brian Keith was so much like Uncle Bill, and it reflected a part of his real family. He had three adopted children besides his own uh, two children. So he always had a wonderful, fond place in his heart for all children. He had cancer, and Brian, being who Brian is, he had been in charge of his own life, was going to be in charge of his own death. So that was another tragic ending. Buffy was so adorable and such a wonderful little girl, bright as could be. And she was expected to, to be a little girl where she wanted to be with her friends and find out who she was. Unfortunately, when the show was ended, she did find some friends, but they were taking drugs, and then she died of an overdose at 18, which was such a tragedy. Johnny Whitaker, he unfortunately went through that same problem as Anissa. After the show, he started drinking, and then he was on drugs, and his family just went in there and said, hey, if you don't get off drugs, we're going to divorce you as a family. So he went into rehab. The only people left from the original cast are Johnny Whitaker and me. 